one of the things is, is be patient and be willing to talk about yourself. Um, m most Americans don't travel outside of the United States, and so when they meet someone who's not from America, there's typically lots of questions because we're very curious. Um, and you shouldn't be intimidated by that. You should just be willing to answer those questions. That means you sort of have to be an ambassador for your country um, in a way. And so you have to be prepared to do that. I think it's important that Ameri to know that Americans value both privacy and personal space. Okay. Um, and I think you yeah. can speak to that a little bit. You want to talk about that? Yeah, it's just like, I feel like keeping an open mind is important, and especially for personal space. Like freshman year, I was living with two Americans and then one Korean. And then I became really good friends with one of the Americans. And then you know, no matter how close we are, when she'll just say, like, can you like leave me alone right now? Because I just don't want to talk to anyone. At first, I'll just say, why? Because you know, in China, we always hang out with each other all the time. And I just didn't realize that she really needs her personal space and personal yeah. time. So that, I get used to it. And now I kind of really need my personal time and personal space sometimes, too. So it's just like. Whenever I go back to China, I'm waiting the air, like waiting for the customs, and then when people stand really close to me, I get really frustrated. I was like, "Can you like give my own? I need my own space. Like, <laughs> don't stand that close." <laughs>